Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I do have a haul video for you, but it is probably going to be relatively short. Um, I went to a grad sale on Saturday. It's been very hot, so there hasn't been a lot. Um, but I did pick up three items there. I picked up, um, I guess you would call it a retail arbitrage buy, but we'll get into that one uh, item. And then I got a handful of things at Salvation Army on Saturday. They were doing a like super summer Saturday sale where everything in the store was half off. I got um, some clothing items and then one uh, bag. So wanted to show you guys what I got there. This is also going to be a shorter video because I am going to be trying out a new editing software and I figure a smaller, shorter video would be great to practice on. So I hope the editing turned out great on this. Um, but yes, so we were gonna go ahead and get started. But one like retail arbitrage kind of item that I uh, have and I picked up is this uh, sports bra, um, or I guess technically a cropped tank top. <laughs> um, it is like this solid kind of lighter pink color. It is strappy on the back here. And it is Athleta. It's a size 3X, which is the size that I wear in Athleta. It is called the Alation Strappy Crop D to Double D. Um, so I went on Friday to a couple of stores with my best friend. We went shopping and um, I happened to find this. Um, new with tags. It retailed for $64. However, we went to Marshall's and I don't normally go there, but um, I was looking through the clearance section and this was originally $12.99 at Marshall's, but they had it marked down to six. And I would absolutely pay that for a new tag item. Um, I will probably go back probably in like a couple days or a couple weeks. I'm not really sure um, when, but they had some Athleta plus size shorts, not any that I would want purely just because I like a longer inseam, but they were the Trekkie style short. Um, and they had those marked at $10. It was a little bit high for what I was kind of wanting to pay. So I'm hoping if I go back, it's on sale even more. But um, I figured I'd try this out. I didn't realize it in the store that it was a crop tank top and it wasn't just a regular sports bra. I don't really like crop tank tops. So I will be listing this, but I would pay $6 new tags at a thrift store for that. So perfectly happy with that. Then, like I said, we went to one garage sale. My husband found all of these and they were $5 each. So um, first off is a Patagonia little long sleeve graphic t-shirt. This one is a size extra large. Um, I love Patagonia tags because they tell you the style number as well as the year it was published or published, put in product, in put into production. Uh, is it this, if this is your first video, I'm not normally like this or maybe I am, I'm not really sure, but <laughs> you should subscribe anyway. Uh, this is from fall of 16, but um, I do really well with like basic Patagonia shirts as long as I price them pretty well. And then another Patagonia shirt. This is a light blue color with a graphic on the front. This one is short sleeve and this one is organic cotton. It is also a extra, extra large. So really good size. And this last one does have some pilling. However, nothing that a sweater shaver can't uh, handle. So it is one of their responsibility t-shirts. So it has that small graphic or spell it on the front and then the big graphic on the back. This one as, as well is uh, the extra, extra large. Uh, so definitely pick those up $5 each. Happy about that. And now we have our half off uh, item. So picked up a couple of bras. This one's just a basic black bra. However, uh, when I was looking and I was like, oh, I know this. It is Spanx. I have sold, I think, one or two Spanx bras before and they've done really well for me. Spanx tags also has the style number, so it makes it very easy to look it up. This one was a 38D. It was $3.99 and at Salvation Army, when things are half off, they round down to what you pay. So um, it was $3.99, it's not gonna be even, so they have it where I paid $1.99 for this. So very excited about that one, as well as this one. This is just a like black kind of um, no wire bra. I believe the style name is Unlined Full Coverage No Wire. It is Kashik or Kasik. It is Lane Bryant's like Intimates line. 
and this one is a 50G. So it is definitely a bigger size. Uh, just needs a little bit of sweater shaving, otherwise in really good condition. And this was also $3.99. So again, paid $1.99 for it. Um, I love picking these up. They're lightweight to ship on Mercari and eBay. And they're pretty quick sellers for me. So this one is just a personal find. It is a Torrid, their activewear line. Really cute, just short sleeve blue shirt. Has like a sun and a wave on it. So this was actually in the men's section. <laughs> My husband found it and just kind of passed, passed it, didn't think anything of it. And then I happened to see it and I was like, oh, I want this for myself. Um, so this was $3.99. So again, paid $1.99 for that. Now this next item didn't have a tag. <laughs> And later when I was looking at my receipt to see just how much they were going to charge me for it, um, I realized they, the guy didn't even ring it up. So this one's technically free. <laughs> um, I have sold this style and picked it up many times. It is Athleta. It is 100% linen and this is their Cabo um, style. This is a size 2P or 2 Petite. And Athleta as well has the tag in here that'll give me the style number. And then this is from spring of 19. However, um, you know, even though it's more than a couple years old, I do really well with this style and it's 100% linen. So I'm going to pick that up, especially when it's free, unintentionally, but it was free. <laughs> And then the last clothing item I picked up is a pair of Levi's. This is um, one of the few styles I pick up. So this is the wedgie straight size 28. It does have a button fly, it's just not buttoned right now. Um, it does have a small mark right there. I'm gonna try and stain treat it, uh, spot treat it. I don't really wanna oxyclean the whole pair just for that one spot. So we'll see if we can get it out. If not, I'll just list it as is. This one was $9.99, so I paid $4.99 for these. Um, I think all of their denim they have marked at $9.99 or up. So glad to get that half off. And then this caught my eye. It is a Kavu bag. And it is the kind of sling backpack style. But look at this adorable little print. I think this is perfect for summer. I need to get it listed ASAP. Um, it's a popsicle print. So it's actually new with tags. So it has um, the name of it, it's the rope bag, and then it's the popsicle party. But you can tell this had some sort of steerance, steerance, clearance sticker on it and they pulled it off because it is now full of lint and hair and all that yuck stuff. So I'm actually gonna pull this tag off, but leave the original Kavu tag and then this tag as well on there. It even still has this that it was hanging with. So um, comps are like 40 to $50. This was $9.99, but again, I paid half of that. So $4.99, great deal if you ask me. But that was all that I have to show you in this haul. I hope you guys really enjoyed it. And if you are not subscribed and you don't mind hearing me mumble jumble over my words, um, I would really appreciate a subscribe from you and you can hit the bell notification that way you're notified every time I put out a video. I am not on a schedule. I try to put one out every week to 10 days, but that doesn't always happen. I do have a full-time job. Uh, we have a almost one-year-old puppy and life is just kind of busy right now. But um, I love putting out reseller related content like hauls like this one, as well as ship with me videos. I have a lot of those recently. So if you want to go check that out as well, give it a watch and thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to give the video a thumbs up on your way out and I will see you in my next one. Bye.